Have you noticed the money being poured into the lesser regarded cars in the model lineup of late? Well, this GS Fairmont was making waves back in the early 90s, even before the big money was being ploughed into GT Falcon restos. Well, welcome to a new Dave's Classic Garage Tours video, and it's back to classic Aussie Ford restorer's Grand Tourer in Melbourne's north for a look over a rather special car. Dan, how you doing, buddy? I'm good, mate. Yourself? Yeah, very well, very well. Well, sure. bloody hell, this is a um, crikey. This is a bit more packed out than yeah. uh, usually. We're, we're almost bursting at the same time. Yeah, at the moment. definitely, definitely. Yeah. We're still all Falcons in here at the moment. Or, or yeah, last time we had a Mustang, didn't we? Yeah, we've still got another Mustang. We've got I'm one in the front say, there. Something, uh, well, we'll hold that for later, eh? Yeah. We'll but um, this one's later. a bit special, I believe. This Not is, a GT, but... Yeah, this uh, is an XY Fairmont GS. Um, this was actually one of the early cars, basically in the 90s, when Neil opened. He opened the business in 1990. Right. And um, this is one of the very early cars that he, he did. Yeah, yeah. Um, so it's been sitting for a fairly long time and um, just come up for a bit of maintenance work and get the thing running again. Um, so is, well, the owner wants to get it back out on the road, yeah? Yeah, he needed to move the car. It was in storage and um, it actually hadn't been out since 2015, I think it was. Right. Um, this is actually the last time here it was out. It yeah. came out for Neil's funeral. Yeah. When Neil passed away. So oh, right, yeah, yeah. He's still got that in the car. Uh-huh. Christ, so, what's that? That's 2015, that's sometime. Yeah, yeah, it is. Oh, wow, that's nine, nine years ago. So, so it's been... yeah, this is a very special car to Grand Tour. Yeah. Like, so a it's of, a lot of good memories with this car and even had this car in my own wedding. Oh, really? So, yeah. Oh, wow. Pretty cool. cool. I always love this one, the colour, teal glow. Absolutely. And was that factory? Yeah, factory colour. Yeah. Um, this car was, when it was built, a lot of the stuff in it, like it's genuine crash pad. The seats were retrimmed in new old stock material. All right. It's even got the factory cloth insert option on the seats. Is any of that still yeah. available? Um, you can still get it, but that's actually genuine new old but stock. Yeah, but yeah. Yeah, um, so you wouldn't be able to, surely that's all gone Yeah, now, there was it? people back in the 90s that still had that stuff right. tucked away, but to try oh, and look, that's find got it. the cloth insert, yeah. 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 Oh, that's bloody beautiful. Yeah, it's actually option with that on the ID plate. Yeah. Oh. Um, it's got factory air conditioning, factory sunroof. So we've got to just, uh, yeah, just make that clear. This is a Fairmont. This isn't a yeah, usual correct. fare of a, of a GT. Yeah. Fairmont um, GS. Yep. Grand Sport. So this car's basically 30 years old the rest though so right as you can see it's it still looks well it stood up quite bloody good. well eh? yeah good well so this car back no, in the day you're gonna pay big money and then just let something uh... yeah this car back in the day was something else like no one restored cars like this back in the 90s right. they were very minimal people you know did it win the awards sort of level yeah back then i remember even lou mentioned the other day that um this car, last time he remembers it out, was they had a Tickford day in the 90s at Tickford when they used to do the XR6s and XR8s. So they put on a show there. Yeah. And this car come out and, yeah, everyone was just wowed by it. Right. Yeah, just that colour combination with the saddle trim and the teal glow. And so what would you stripes. call the trim again? Sorry? The trim, what would you call it? Uh, saddle trim. Saddle. Saddle. Yeah. Yep. God, it looks bloody yeah, spectacular. So what's... um. Is there been any you know sort of wear that you've had to you know, rubbers or anything like that? Yeah, just little bits and pieces. So we're going over the car and just doing a bit of maintenance. He actually couldn't get the car running because he had to move the car right. somewhere else. So um, wouldn't start, and then um, he gave us a call. And he's been meaning to get it into us for a fair while, but just um, he hasn't had the time and other commitments. So yeah, um, yeah the car's finally come in here, yeah. come in on a tow truck, and um, we've just been going over it. We've Done a service on it. Um, we're going to reco the carby. It's got right. a little bit of a fuel leak, so it's just yeah. it's been sitting a long time. So those sort of things perish. And yeah. So is there anything new that you added then that's sort of being made better now with better production yeah. techniques and whatever? Yeah, there'd be a little bit of stuff. I mean, we're sort of doing minor works on this and just um, going over the brakes and all that stuff. It's got the rear wheel cylinders are leaking a bit of fluid and stuff like that. It's all from sitting. Um, right. So yeah. yeah, just fuel sender. Just as cars do, like they, that. Yeah. they need to be used, don't they? Yeah, we've pulled all the fuel out the tank and all that sort of stuff. So Is that pretty... Uh, 
Yeah, the fuel Probably. wasn't too bad actually because he'd recently put some fresh stuff oh, in right. it. Okay. And, uh, just under the bonnet. So it's still got the Ooh. factory original two barrel Stromberg carburetor yep. on the Windsor V8. Right. So. so this is obviously, you know, it's a, a GS. A lot of money was poured into a GS back in. Yeah, that, did that sort of yeah. do people's minds in? That it probably did, would... yeah, yeah. I would say why. Yeah. Because you know, everyone would have spent the money, if you're going to restore a car, do a GT. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, to do this. And that's probably why it was so unique. Right. Because there wasn't many done, especially a GS, to sure. this level. Yeah, yeah. So. Oh, it's a cracking. Like yeah. So. It needs, did, a, did needs they... a good detail and clean, but yeah, it's a bit... There's been a few cobwebs and dust and stuff under it, but... Did, did you have any um, GTs come through in this colour? Uh, yeah, there were... I think that believe there was a couple made in Teal Glow, XY right. GTs. Right, yep. OK. So that's, yeah. uh... I actually think the... We were just discussing it the other day. The Fairmont's actually look better with the Teal Glow rather than a GT because all the chrome work. You've yeah. got all the wheel arch moulds and, yeah. uh, you know, all the anodised moulds and all the stainless sort of from chrome and yeah, everything yeah. on the So you wouldn't, uh, this isn't, do you, do you have that on a GT? No, 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 no so, so, so a GT, basically yeah, the only bit of stainless is this quarter vent frame coming right. down here in your windscreen mould. And it has these blacked out, the door frames oh, are blacked course, out. Yes, the yes. XY GT has this, XW Actually, doesn't. So we can just look over the top there, can't we? There, yeah, so. correct. There's a GT yeah. there. Yeah, that one's missing the lower stainless moulds, but. Right, okay. Yeah, that's a replica of that one. Okay. And then, yeah, yeah pretty much the options on it, like it's a I, bit of a hamburger with a lot. Sort like of you say, that that's that's the the colour really does ping with the uh, with the chrome, doesn't it? Yeah, and the and the brown. Yep. The the saddle. I love right. this car. This was probably one of my favourites. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you get it in for your wedding. I'm sure yep. it is. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's a spectacular looking thing. No problem. I mean, it's been out of the sun, so there's no problems with the dash. Yeah, all that's good. So all that crash pad, everything's all genuine day one. Right. So oh, no cracks cracker. or anything. Yeah. Beautiful. So, and this is a X? XY. Y, which would be what year? Uh, this one, I think it's a 1971. 71. Oh, have a look. Oh, here we go. Yeah, it's a 71 XY. Yeah. So is there any upgrades from factory in for performance in here or is this a really probably the only thing? thing's probably the headers it's had uh, it's got pacemaker right headers on it but okay that's probably the only thing in the engine bay you still get them today Pace. yeah yeah you can still yeah. buy all that stuff so yeah um, and the uh well they have chrome hubcaps today or yeah so they've got a polished um stainless cap right that's so polished stain i can actually it? show you one on the wheel what they look like Oh, right, yeah. So they push over over the cat. Lovely. And what's um, the upkeep of uh, stainless steel um, wheels and that? Is that... Uh, yeah, a bit of auto sole polish or whatever. Yeah, right. just cleans them up. Yeah. Yeah, it stays pretty good. But no, no sort of rust issues? Or, no, no, stainless is pretty good, yeah. Right. Don't really have much in the way of rust and yeah. stuff, so... Am I talking dumb there, for saying stainless rust? Nah, no, no. Nah. Of course it would still rust though, wouldn't it? It depends if it's, um, it's yeah, it, it'd get rust tarnish. If it's like got steel or something yeah. behind it and that's rusting, it's going to get stained. Yeah. Generally stainless is pretty good rust wise, right. it won't rust itself. Okay. All right, mate, well, and uh, how, what's left to do? Uh, just a uh, fuel sender, we're doing that now. Yeah. And she certainly looks fantastic. So. New one on me, this colour combo. And the fact, like I say, it seems you're spreading your wings now, doing more uh, different stuff. I see you're, um, well, more yeah. things are coming through, a lot yeah. more cars. Yeah, a lot more cars, and um, we're just spreading it out over all the models yeah. and everything. So, Great yeah. Stuff. yeah. And we've got the ESP coming back soon, so that's one probably a lot of looking forward to that. Up. And yeah. Uh, yeah, it's all painted now, so. Great. Yeah, that'll okay. be back in the next couple of weeks. Okay, well, there's a couple yeah. more we're going to have a look at. Yep. Let's do that then.
Okay, lovely.